is small. You still recording, bud? Okay. But it is mighty. The Kennedy Fire Department is just starting to think about all the ways the drone can help. It'll be pretty useful to us for search and rescues, hazmat calls, a situation where you can't get close. These things cost thousands, but Don Martin from Martin Communications just donated it. They send the drone up and they're able to see what is happening, you know, above ground, whereas human eye can only see so far. As a camera on it, you get able to zoom in, zoom out, get to places you can't normally get to. Today is a practice day. It takes some time to get used to. It's like playing a video game, so we'll figure it out. Um, it gives you the advantage, kind of get an overhead view of what's going on where you can't always see everything when you're there in person. And when you, you spawn to hazmat incidents where you can't get close to a scene due to gases or other chemicals, we can fly right over and actually get a, a close up view of what's going on. Keep in mind, there are FAA regulations for drones. This one can go 400 feet up and half a mile away from the operator. And they're hoping that's powerful enough to make a difference when lives are on the line, something Don Martin knows about. As a firefighter myself, if it's going to save lives, we want to do it. Some training with that new drone. They hope to put it into action sometime very soon.